Hi. Um, I know I haven't read you yet, but um, there's this game. You basically, uh, you get to like put things on the ground and and pick things up and put trees down and stuff and have animals. You know, like you, I can put it down. Can I play it? Please. I know, I understand that there's that whole blasphemy thing and all that, but oh, it's a game. It's just a game. That helps. Huh? Can? Okay. That means I'm going where? Where? Where am I going? I'm gonna go play the game now. I'll see you soon. Don't blame me. Blame the devs. All right. I didn't make the game. I didn't make the game. They put on the they put on the Steam store, and you know I just took my little little balance out of my pocket and bought it. I don't want to go. I don't want to go to hell. Just let me play the game. All right. You know, I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna do this. All right. Give him a kiss a couple times. I'm gonna play this game. I'm gonna repent. Just get off my sack. Just get off my sack, all right? Please, please, do what I for. <laughs> Hello everyone, Barrel Fight Club here. Today we're gonna to be playing God Simulator World Box. Now, I played this game on the phone when it first came out. I enjoyed the life out of it, I'm not gonna lie. It was amazing. I would be getting my phone, touching up things, you know, creating items, but you know, I don't want to get put in the realm of hell. Me and the guy had a conversation, and it didn't go too well. But, but, he'll understand, man. He'll understand. Hope you enjoy. Make sure you like us, subscribe, and let's subscribe. And let's get into it. Let's get into it. <laughs> also, I wanted to take a little break from pizza tower because it's making my blood just boil right now I don't know I'm not a fan of it right now at the moment super well is a game about creation and destruction the controls are simple WSD arrows to move cameras Q and E control zoom to feedback all your powers are at the bottom of the panel here are some important buttons press anywhere to continue save the button save it on order and I'm gonna come out of custom worlds create worlds with bigger size guys I need um a quick pointer when it comes to the OBS studio because you know how you can record your face cam and your screen at the same time. I think I'm fumbling by not doing that. Sorry to go off on another tangent. But, um, yeah, if someone wants to comment down in the comment section, or this is how you do that, then uh, by all means, I really, really be appreciated. I could watch a YouTube video instead. Like I have been doing this whole time. Just, no, just never mind. Shut the fuck up. Your civilization, destruction powers. Here you can find bombs and nukes. Well, that's not very good, isn't it? Other various powers and menus. There's so much stuff in there. Try them, try them out and experiment. Enjoy the game, the creator, heart. I watched a video on this and this guy basically made two factions start beefing. That's what I want to do in this game. I want to make a bunch of little islands and I want them to start migrating, see if they would start gathering resources, sharing resources. Um, eventually when the trees run down, run out, well, the, the fruits run out, let's see what happens there. You know, but on specific islands, I want to give them a little less resources, you know. Give someone a bit more trees here, a bit more shrubs here. How do I clean this? How do I, like, clean this whole entire section up? Let's see here. Change your settings here. World box community. Create a new world. Yes, that's it. Create a new world. Um, First thing we're going to do is start off with the land. Because you can't, you can't live without land. You know what I'm saying? You can't live without land. What I'm saying is if you guys can go to a little island or something, buy some land. Hopefully no tsunamis will run run your fucking island down. Culture. So it's culture zones. Create and shape your world. This is probably what I'm going to do. Plain soil here. Alright. So, as I said, I want to do like five different factions with different resource resource um, availability. So we're going to draw a little faction here. Keep them all relatively the same size. Plan is to get some forest soil. Oh. Oh. oh okay. Oh. Forest soil, place that there. I don't know, I'm pretty sure I could just drop some trees down rather than doing all this crazy, crazy smazy stuff. 
But this is just my speed of game, man. Pixels, chilling, grilling, you know? I don't have to worry about running left and right and bouncing all over the gaff like in some games. You know what I'm talking about. I can just, you know, sit and chill and wait. Who doesn't want to do that? Who doesn't want to do that? It's like passive income right here. Fruit bush. I want food to be kind of abundant. Uh, it just dies as soon as I place it, isn't it? Because there's no... Yeah, okay. Um, What am I supposed to do here, though? Where are the trees? Trees fertilizer. Uh, grass seeds. Oh, okay, okay. Nice. Shout out to the developers of this game because they've been really working. They've been working for a while, you know? Started off on the phone, then they put it on PC. When I saw this game on Steam, I was like... Started palpitating. My heart started jumping and bumping, bro. I'm telling you. Now that we have general vegetation going on, we can start getting some people, and humans and civilization, just planted down, you know? Uh, but where's the regular humans? The thing is, though, when I was doing research on this game, it's like, orcs are green and brutish creatures, they don't like humans. Are you telling me, if I place orcs everywhere here, they're not gonna start beefing? So what I'm gonna do, get some humans, put some there. You know, just randomly press press them down a little bit. Already creating their own factions. Look, I've put them on an island together so they can work together. But no, no, I don't want to do that. Oh, this island's already got a little bit of a fiery situation going on. Look, we've already started building. Placed all the people. I think I, I overdid it for some of these islands, and I really neglected this one here. So I'm gonna give them a little bit of a touch up here. Uh, zoom out here, little touch up here, little touch up here, little touch up here, little touch up here, and a little touch up here. Wait, no, here, 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 and here. So over here we have two factions, Efdrun and Turk. They're building and spilled on here, you know, they're starting their own little civilizations, which is pretty cool. Already got houses, fire places going, you know, they're doing all right. Um, Then we have Ihoro and Dachovo. They're doing cool too, chilling out, doing the same things. All right, humans are kind of doing the same things here and there. Ooh, but I'm guessing these guys had a little bit of a head start because they had civilization planted on their, their um, land first because they've built a nice little bridge system here. I'm guessing they're going to start building boats to migrate to different islands. Hey, I'm calling it. And Mencina are the ones that are going to pop off, bro, because look what they're doing already. Look what they're doing already. Fireplace, campfires, uh little boat area they even they even made boats okay these guys are doing a boat thing too all right all right all right okay never mind never mind everyone's on a pretty even playing field at the moment these guys are a little slow but what i want to do now actually is give them some animals i want to give them some animals let's start them off slow by giving them non-hostile animals like chickens or sheeps I kind of don't want them to kill the animals though you know what I mean I want to see if they're gonna develop some kind of clothing system uh let's take some sheeps let's give them like one two three four four sheeps one two three four sheeps here and over here we will do up cows one two three four cows here and let's let's see if we can just troll one of the islands you know these guys are doing pretty good numbers wise so i want to throw a couple monkeys down just to just disturb disturb them a little bit so let's throw some monkeys down here you know what crack it out throw a few monkeys down um oh actually there's this documentary um places in africa where they eat monkey meat like dried monkey meat and they go fucking nuts let's see if they've done their research okay if they start eating monkey meat, I can stop saying monkey meat. If they start eating monkeys, then uh, they might go crazy and start pillaging everybody. Do you know what I think? You know what I think we need to do over here, actually, because we threw a bunch of cows down. We need one of these, and you know they're about to get busy. Oh, look, he's a little bit nervous. Look, he's watching her from a distance, but he's oh, he's oh, he's a bit nervous, man. Come on, come on. She's looking at you. She's just standing there. Especially if you want to upgrade homes. Uh, silver. Ooh. Maybe we should crack out one of the islands to, to have 
a bunch of expensive, sh expensive stuff. So this middle island here, but I want it to be like a small island. So that if it's a small island, I have a bunch of gold. You already know. Efren will just swim over there, pillage, kill, take their gold, bring it back, and start flipping it. You know what I mean? Oh, oh! What do we have over here? Tornado. Seems pretty chill. Staying in the waters, which is probably not what you want. Oh, let's see what these guys are doing with the with the silver and gold that I've placed here. So they're liking the silver. All right, the two okay, two factions are functioning with different metals. So Ihoro is liking silver, and and uh, Dachovo is dealing with the gold. They've harvested it already very quickly. Um, over here, bro, they've literally yoinked every little piece of stone I threw down there. Damn, damn. Okay, these guys are doing really well. As soon as you give them a resource, they pump it straight back into their into their land. As you should do. As you should do. Ooh, nice little shot. Do a little crystal biome over here. Um, Candy seeds. Oh my gosh, what's happening here? What's happening here? What happened? Oh my lord. The Vacho is getting... They're getting crimbimped right now. Yeah, their numbers are going down. Shall I be a good god? I'm gonna be a good god. Praise be the lord. Damn. Alright, alright. <laughs> ooh, ooh, ooh. You think they might have... Oh no, wait, hold on. What is this? These little flame bastards. Where did they come from? That's who's doing it. Oh. How does this logically make any sense? I'm gonna put you guys down. Damn. Alright. I guess that was that. Middle Island is, is done for. Alright, things are progressing a lot over here. These guys are keeping it humble, you know? That's why they're doing quite well. And... Ignisk, Ignisk. However you spell to say that or spell that. Ignisk. Enchanted seeds create enchanted biome sparkling. Swamp seeds, jungle seeds. Savannah seeds. All right, these guys are just a bit too comfortable, you know? Let's just... Hmm. Do one of these. Okay. All right. I feel bad now. Um, I feel really bad. Anyway. They'll sort it out. They have numbers. They have numbers. They, that's not an issue for them. They can fix that. I kind of want. I kind of want to crack them out a little bit. Um. Oh, let's see if we can make them survive a little bit. Oh, let's give them stone. Resource rich. Make them resource rich. Give them fruit. Give them some fruit. And you see, I'm a good. I'm a. I'm a good god. Oh, there's only one. There's only one left. Can we keep him alive? Oh, no, no, don't walk in the fire. Don't walk in the flames. Uh, what can we do for him? What can we do for him? Oh, oh, I don't want to give him any more animal. Let's, let's give him, let's give him some animals. Oh, okay, no, no, no. Um, what can we do for him? Uh, we shall bless him with, no, a druid. A druid who likes to grow grass. Why not? It's a miracle. She came from the skies of the air to bless this little Davacho Dachovo member with her elemental praises and blessings. Why not? Maybe what needs to happen is a few more humans. Still humor who's not fair, man. Go fuck those guys up. Go fight them. All right. Maybe I shouldn't have done that. So it seems like these hell spawns are like the center of any town you build because they're they're just here. They're not, they're, they're, they're not going over any, anywhere else, you know. It's kind of deep. Now I'm curious. Oh, I'm curious to see what the monkeys are getting up to over here. I didn't want to press that. Let's see what the monkeys are getting up to over here. Did they kill them? I think they killed the monkeys as soon as I put them down there. One way to deal with a 
bunch of dickheads. I didn't put the I didn't put the these devil devil spawns down. I didn't do it, okay? So if they want to inhabit this area, by all means, I'll let them. I'll let them. Let's see how they deal with the with the humans, you know? It, I'm my hypothesis is if I start allowing these guys to thrive and grow, they're gonna get very powerful and just fucking bop everybody around here. Or the humans are gonna just be like you. By the way, there's some devils in the center. We gotta deal with them now, okay? I know we got beef with Vialhawa and Guapa, but we gotta go center and deal with these motherfuckers right here. Hold on, the druid might come in clutch, to be honest. Is she doing any damage? Alright. Okay, okay, okay. Alright. Oh, she's doing damage. She's zoning the life out of them. Oh, okay. Boom. Flame tower right here. The demons come together to create this flame tower let's put a bunch of rocks and musty resources around their little town why am i so addicted to actually helping these fucking guys out what's wrong with you josh let's go find out these these god-fearing people over here what they're doing they seem pretty good they're chilled chilled out everyone here's chilled out paving roads and everything now I don't know, they must have not heard the news about the center of the, the whole area because what's happening here? She's kind of just clutching it up, clutching up because he has no idea where this stuff is coming from. He's just like, I keep getting vines and, and thorns slithering through my booty. Ooh, wait, hold on. Hold on, they're creating an army. This is the problem with having volcanoes, it creates more land. More land means these guys can go over here and start burning people down. All right, so. I think these are these are the guys that start, why does it keep doing that these are the guys that start oh no um oh they've batted together fair enough they, they must have pulled up on some yo our goal is to just take you out do so you wear our t-shirts and you're done hey fair play smart choice personally if i got my little clan we're chilling and these guys try and bully us you already know we're gonna die by our sword man we're gonna stand around acting all done huh hell no oh okay all right they're all doing pretty similar things all right okay all right so uh, this makes sense the island is too Ooh, hold on they got a little windmill over here nice 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 okay these guys are these guys are growing over here they've Created roads, bridges, and little fireplaces. I don't know. Don't really, don't really know what these guys are doing, to be honest. Somehow this got set on fire. That's not good. That's not good. Just gotta stay calm. Hopefully they learn from this though. They might start developing islands that are a little bit more tornado preventative. I wonder when that tornado is gonna stop. It's a bit deep. A bit deep man these guys were doing so well as well oh you poor little creatures yeah it's like all the islands just dealing with a bunch of bullshit and they can't even like migrate to each other or maybe the distance is a little bit too too buffy stuffy all right what i'm gonna do because these guys aren't beefing as quick as i want them to i'm going to build a nice little road section go into all of them like that like a little square they're building houses there. Why are you building a house there? Don't do that. Um. Ooh, okay. The animals seeming to run away from the humans because I think the humans are just bopping them up. Makes sense. <sighs> All right, guys, I'm a bit retarded. I'm gonna have to put, move the camera over here because there's notifications that appear in the top left that I've covered the whole entire time. Yeah, you're gonna have to do a bit better than that. I don't know how well trained your people are, but. Whoa, what's going on here? What's going on here? Damn, that tornado will not leave their island alone. I think. The... Oh! <gasps> These guys are some dickheads, man! They must have heard news about a tornado happening in this island. They thought, okay, now it's our time to come and pillage, kill, and destroy the kids, bro. Oh, they're taking. Oh! 
no way. No way. No way. That quick. Nah. Nah. That is not very good. Not very good at all. I put these mountains down, but I don't know if they even do anything. Let's see what's happening here. See, these guys are just doing their thing. They're just doing their thing. Oh, what's this? What's this? Like a coal thing? Who's this guy? Giant. Wise. Golden tooth. Symbol of wealth and respect. You know, I haven't seen in the UK. I've never seen a, a guy with a full grill. Like a full section, just Florida style. But wow. Things are starting to develop now. I think with this game is a little bit of a waiting, waiting thing. Damn, damn. The tornadoes here. Why? Why is that? Why is that the case? Oh, well, let's do some research quickly. Do tornadoes happen? I can't spell. Tornadoes happen. Tornadoes occur when warm, humid air collides with cold, dry air. The denser the cold air is pushed over the warm air, usually producing thunderstorms. The warm air rises through the color, colder air, causing an updraft. The updraft will begin to rotate if the winds very sharply from the direction when warm and humid air collides so essentially if it's cold if it's colder they will have less tornadoes right right so what i'm gonna do because i'm a good guy i'm going to get some snow snow Snow, 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 snow. Could be a hypothermia. Oh, man. Okay. The snow is going to go everywhere. Oh. And their food supply is going to run low, maybe, because it's cold. It's all right. One side can be a little snowy to prevent the the, the tornado from, from spinning their heads off. Anyway, I think it worked. But now they have another issue. <laughs> I bet, I bet God is up there like, oh shit, a tornado. It's because it's too warm and humid. Give them some snow. Oh shit, their fruit stopped growing and their herbs and the whole agri agriculture is just done for. They have no more food. Damn, throw some animals down there. Oh shit, the animals are killing them. Damn, because they're bigger and stronger. It's cold. I mean, forget the animals. It's too cold. Throw some sheep down there. Give them some sort of warm clothes to wear there's nothing really happening here so what i'm gonna do throw some rain down here because they ain't doing nothing they're just wandering around like is this what you is this all you wanted to do all you guys wanted to do was come out of nowhere because i didn't put you here kill a bunch of people and stand still you don't want to build no houses you don't want to do nothing like that start a little revolution of your own you see that's why humans are the goated people bro because even if we go and we're not really in my opinion bro humans we're not bad, but we're also not good. We're just like, nuchi boochi. We're just like here all the time. These guys are just straight up dickheads. All they did was come and kill people and now they're just walking around. And I tried giving them some kind of resource to, to manage like stone, but they just, they just don't, they just don't want to do nothing. I don't know why they're not fighting. Fight, do something, hurt each other. There was one little, little event that happened here where they just went over here to here, but other than that, nothing's really going on. Nothing that I want to happen is going on, at least. I want them to start, you know, stabbing each other up. And force a kingdom to make peace. Spite. Force a kingdom to stop. Ooh. I'm declared water. Now we're talking. Am I evil? Ooh, you see this is why why the minute the minute you start putting some evil shit down this is where people are like all right let's get some boats and put some metal on the back of it why see over here they doing the same thing okay no maybe these guys aren't oh, yeah they're doing it as well they're putting weapons on their on their Ooh. you see proof is in the pudding without war there will be no progression i want problems always are they starting to make babies or no like these guys are just boring all right my plan is to do more videos on this game if you guys have any suggestions leave it in the comments it's been your boy barrel fight club 
Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, like, comment, comment. Please comment. I want to engage with people, to be honest. I want this to be a community where we talk, have fun, we bullshit in the comments, we mess around. There's no limits to what we can say or do. Because we ain't no bloody snowflakes. We ain't no pussmusses. We're humans. We're people, right? If you enjoyed the video, like, subscribe, comment, do all that shit. All of it. If you didn't, do it anyway. Because I'm only getting better at this YouTube stuff. Only getting better. All right, calm down. But yeah, for real. If you enjoyed this video, leave a comment. Because comments are, are, are way more. I value I value engagement from, from people way more than anything else. Subscribe. Subscribing. Don't give a shit about that. Liking. I don't give a shit about that. I just want comments under my videos. I want to respond to comments. I want to talk to you guys. You know, have a lot of fun. And hey, start your YouTube channel too. Start your little TikTok thing. I was one of those guys who were like, oh man, TikTok is moist. YouTube is moist. Well, not YouTube is moist. I like YouTube, but short form content is the way to go. Blah, blah, blah. I just wasn't a fan of that. So let's, let's bring this. What happened? Let's bring this back. Before we get back into this game on a tangent and go crazy. If you enjoyed the video, I've already said that. All right. And I'll see you in the next one. What chaos. Goodbye, guys.